Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 2 Because to reload this internet demand Now Here's the thing I'm gonna try to get summoned But I don't think I will Get summoned But if I don't Well there's really no way I can actually handle that Situation So I placed my marker And I will explore a little bit around And then we will try the fight. Once I've been summoned and I may maybe get some SS flasks and such back. Maybe that all depends on whether or not I actually... Whoa! Whoa! Okay, never try to kiss the painting again. Oh shit! I forgot about this room. Another thing to worry ourselves over. Oh, great. This is so much to this whole area. Like a bit, a little bit too much it feels at times. Especially with the 5,000 or so things we have going on over here. Okay, none of these guys woke up from the dead, right? The statue mess, even. They're not dead, they're just statues. But this guy could just be taken out like that, right? Yeah. This guy doesn't want to go on a date. Too bad for him, I'm taking him out anyway. Boom. Uh, I feel like I should buy the upgrade version of the Bracing Knuckle Ring while we're here. Because my axe has taken a fair bit of damage here. I don't like it. Welcome, I guess. Tell me. Alright, uh, sell me that ring again. Thank you. Goodbye. Gone so soon. Yep. Be safe. I'll try. Don't promise anything. This area is a nightmare. Nightmare, I say. I have reason to return to somewhere else. Okay. Can we? What lies behind this door? It appears to be a throne room of some sort. Huh. Alright, I guess this is for later. Or when we come to claim the throne. As our own, because apparently that's what we have the right to do. At a point. In the future. Hi. What are we hiding behind that? How did that not hit me? Oh, we're in blossoms. Nice. Mimic? Probably not. This, there's not enough space here for Mimic. Might be trapped there. Not even that. Just some sublime bone dust. Sublime. You're the only one waking up then? Okay, cool. Back to sleep you go! Oh. 
That's what they meant by door, but impossible. Okay, cool. You wanna go? Look at all my footprints. I've been carrying a lot of dirt into these green gas and holes. You know? Lots of dirt. So much dirt. So really there was no reason to come back up here. Okay then, um... In that case, I'm gonna rest up and try to avoid all of the giant things this time. So I will have more than three Estus flasks when I get to the top. And once I get to the top, I will do the thing. Wait, no, if we're gonna do that anyway, we may as well head to things with Vix and then to Majula. Since everything has been respawned already, yeah. And then we can human up there and we can be pretending to be of some use to someone. I can't promise I will be of any use to anyone over there, but still. Okay, uh, inventory. You, you, give us food. Yes, you, give us Suki. Yes, here, have this. Have this. Have this. And this. And you can have this as well if you ask nicely. Maybe even this. What do we get? We get 24 Dragon Bone, awesome. Crimson Water, I have no idea what it does. Fidric Stone, cool. Amber Herb, eh. Uh, sort of Lost Undead, eh. Uh, and Twinkling Titanite, awesome. Cool. We did well this time. But I think we need another Twinkling Titanite before we can actually use Twinkling Titanite for anything. So, what we're gonna do now is... We're gonna get on this thing again to drown the Majula. Yes! And I'm just gonna level up for, uh, four times, I think. I think they should be able to. And I'm gonna burn this sublime bone dust. Awesome. Some force indeed. Alright, and you? Bearer of Let's level me up. Okay. We've got the option to get more health or... Let's do a couple more endurances and a couple more ad adaptabilities. Wait, oh. I was wrong. That's okay, I have souls. I'll use up the souls. Come on. Give me those souls. All of them. For me. Um, we'll also get some additional strength, maybe? And then one more level of both endurance and adaptability, and then we're good. Thank you. And... Bye. We're gonna head back into... Ooh, there's a... L Since when do we know every location in the world? We haven't actually fought the looking glass night night yet, so we shouldn't have all this information I think. We're even missing a bonfire in the forest of fallen giants. That's surprising. Huh. Alright. Cool. Well, I'm heading back to the Ging's Gate because I have no idea where else to go there. And then I'm gonna see if I can manage this. Nope, that's still following me. Let's try another staircase. Oh no, no, okay. 
I'm gonna treat this as no, no, we're good. Then I'm gonna just fight this fun guy. I believe. So when I say fight, I mean more like annihilate. Yeah. Same thing, basically. And the main thing is still the fact that we have activated this trap room. I think we have the life gems for it. Two. Wait. We poisoned. Thought these were standard life gems. Did they use them in such quick succession that they didn't? They actually overpowered the poison. Oh, nice. But I know you all got all about the fight, so I should have taunted you one at a time. How long have you guys been able to do magic anyway? What the hell was that? I've never seen that move before. And when you pull off a move you've never seen before, you usually end up dying. Alright, now. Uh, let's just hope no one's get getting resurrected again. No one did get resurrected again. Which means we can still just go straight for this guy. Face me! Face me like a dwarf! Why a dwarf? I don't know. Guess dwarves have armor apparently. Well, yeah, you can't actually avoid being poisoned in that room. Unless you have the miracle for it, but, you know, I don't. Because there's a miracle that completely allows you to ignore all sorts of poisons and the like. This is not the miracle I possess. Because this character doesn't do any miracles at all. Quite a mundane little fella. I think the most miraculous thing he has is a cave. Because that's wonderful. Science armor? Oh, really? When I see that. That's the Kermori armor. Very science armor. So it's lighter, but it doesn't have as great stats. But look at it. Oh. It's beautiful. Plus, it also has a cape. Hmm. I'll have to consider it, that's for certain. But in that case, I would have the, need to have the entire set, you know? With gauntlets and everything. I could maybe keep the helmet? But it certainly need like, uh, pants and the like. Like a boss. There we go. Fighting like a badass. Alright. There's she again. I think this is the point where I do human up. 
I should probably also look around for potential AI companions for this, maybe. I don't really know. You know, there might be a summon sign around here somewhere that we haven't seen before because I've been dead every time. Well, hollowed. Which, quite frankly, is the consequence of being dead. Oh well. And there's loot down there, we should probably check it out at some point. Though it's also probably going to turn all those free stone crossbowmen into actual combatants. Which sounds less than ideal. Ah, there is a summon sign, it's a AI thingy. The pilgrim. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it, that's better than nothing. I'd wager. Especially if my memory does not betray me. And this is the boss fight. Oh no, this is just two dragon riders. One of them is a, the bull one. Oh, cool. What makes it cool is because I'm using the Dragon Rider bow myself, you know, most of the time. But I did mean less fast right now. Okay, this guy is quite dead looking. But so am I if I'm not dodging or anything. This guy seems to have like the light dragon rider armor. So it just got another dragon rider sword? Um cool. Did not quite expect that. That's a lot of gold in this room. Why can't I loot any of this? I need it for my future throne room, of course. Ah, friend. Hello. What are you doing here? Oh, well met, friend. Good to see you well. Yes, I'm very good indeed. I journeyed from the distant east to perfect my swordsmanship. The legend has it that powerful beings slumber in this land. This sword has been in my family for generations. And only a real man can wield it true. I may face any man, a man or beast, but none shall be a match for my sword. <laughs> this land is a right mess, eh? King's gone. The people have a mad glint in their eyes. The land itself is overrun by terrible beasts. No better place to test my sword, eh? <laughs> this land is the right king of the land. No better. Thank you for your information, buddy. Ooh, I don't know where I'm going. Ooh, I don't think it's a good idea. Ooh. What does this lever do? Why can't I use it? Ooh, I guess it's an elevated thingy. Oh, there's a door here. And it's locked. Ooh, and I should stop doing the sound. Ooh, yeah. Sorry about that. Alright, let's get up here. Point, 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 point. Dropping inside the head. Then maybe not this time? There's a door there. I'm sure we can use that door. Da 
That's a statue. That's a statue. That's a statue. That's a ghost. Or a spirit of some kind. Either way. Either way. Yeah. Okay, I have this, this flask. Keeps kicking statues. That's a statue. 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 I guess this corner then? That's a statue. Um. That's a statue. That's a statue. That's a statue. Maybe someone in the walls? That's a statue. What? The very of giant. Oh, oh. You mean... Is this what you mean? If I should be wary of Chant, did I just do the wrong thing? Is he instead going to kill me? Or is he gonna fix the stairwell? Oh, he's gonna fix the elevator. Nifty. Why does it do the jump? It said beast ahead, so this should be a mimic, right? No, is this the mimic then? No! I just have some mimic, what's going on? What beast were you referring to? Or is it saying the weapon is a beast? Like capable of wrecking major shit. Horse ahead. Sense hold the head. Why are you here? Why are we here? I think this is where I'm going this episode. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I don't like the fact that we have to fight the horsey. I'm not even sure we do have to fight the horsey. But it's what we're doing. And it's going to happen either way.